Hello everybody, it is I, the Willowigy Big Mac, and welcome back to Splatoon. Last time we, well, we mostly cleared uh, World 3 here. Uh, we just have to fight the boss. Uh, I would also, I would also like to mention that uh, OBS nearly had a fucking meltdown. So, so did the, so did the, uh, the software on my computer that displays, that displays the, uh, the footage being captured on, on my cap, on my Elgato capture card. Both of them had a giant hissy fit and just refused to work. I had to, um, I had to re-plug in my uh, capture card just for the one to work. And then I had to, and then I had to re-put in the, uh, uh, and I had to, what do you call it? Re-add in the capture card onto OBS. Because apparently the other one just decided to just do fuck all. Well, big complete uh, aside. Well, let's see how we, well, let's see how we're going to kill this bad boy. Once again, you're going to get yoinked by a giant oct octarian tentacle. Oh, it's a ball. Oh, I see. It's supposed to be, it's supposed to be a clam. Alrighty. Now, I don't remember how this boss fight works. As... Actually, I don't remember most stuff about the, uh... Uh-oh. Woo! I need, I need to do a better job covering the, uh, the stage here. Yeah, I don't remember, uh... Oh, oh okay, there we go. So, so it works, so it works like the, uh, those, uh, rolling enemies. Uh, those, those, uh, yeah, it works like those rolling enemies, uh... Oh, not the stage moves. Well, anyway, yeah, so, essentially, just... I, I, I get the whole gimmick now. Just make, just make sure the, uh, just make sure the whole area is covered in your ink. Have and just wait for them to roll in it like a like the doofus they are. And now I'm assuming some areas, yep, some areas cannot be inked on. Well, I'm gonna have to make sure this middle area is all good. Okay, that wasn't good enough. Good to know. Good to bloody know. I keep running out of ink. This is very, this is very bloody annoying. Wow, that's still not fucking enough, huh? Ain't alive here. Begrudgingly. How fucking hard is this? Come on. Just stop. There we go. God. No reason for that to take multiple tries. But anyway, Paul should be dead now. Yep. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. And there we go. Oh, well that was some that was something, ain't it? Mm. Hot, hot thing, Agent 3, you're on fire! But I've got a bad feeling about well eh, I'll just I'll just go take a quick look myself. By the way, I've been meaning to uh, introduce you to Agent 1 and 2. Once we're once we're all sampled, I'll bake some crabby cakes. Cuddle fish. 
No, you, it can't be. God, time to face the, mu the music old timer. Wait, 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 wait. Grr. Stop. No. Scratch one. Cuttlefish. So, it sounds like something happened to good old cuddle cuttlefish. Also, again, we're not doing sunken scrolls much. And once again, we sort we shorted out the uh, the electric sockets there. So, uh, causing another power surge per usual. Anyway, time to move on to the next area. Honestly, I only see uh, I only see like probably like a few more episodes if I had to say. Cause I I I don't know how long how long this area is gonna is gonna be. Well, I already know where one area is. Oh, here's level sixteen. Nothing they can do about the heat seeking uh, bombs here. Man, man, he wasn't even aware. Sucks, sucks to be him, I guess. Oh, I see now. Well then, so far this level seems pretty simple. Just uh, pull out, pull out the fans here. Ah, uh, eh, we don't need the armor. I'll be honest, like, the arm, like armor is not necessary. Like if you're good enough, you, 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 if you're good enough, you, you don't have to worry about getting killed. Wow, okay, just like that. Well, I might as well grab the armor. I mean, if, I mean, if it's that close, and there's no risk to grabbing it, might as well. God, stop covering this area with, her, with your purple goo. Nobody likes you. Uh oh. Well, well, it definitely paid all. No question. Aha. Oh. oh, god damn it. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, there we go. Die, please. There we go. Oh, I, I have like three layers of armor on, huh? 
Over here, dumb. Dumbass. There we go. What are you doing here? Get out of here. Oh boy. Now it's time. Ooh, now I get to have fun. Let's see. We're gonna sh shoot you right there. Uh, not hit anything, apparently. Oh, interesting. Just gotta cover this area, uh, with ink first. There we go. I might as well. Well, actually, if I just stay underground, they would not know I'm here. I mean, like, it's not, like, it's not, like, you're not required to murder everything you see. Okay, okay that guy I'm gonna have to kill. Power checkpoint, yes? Yep. Just give me those, uh, those eggs real quick. Thank you very much. Oh. Nice one. Wow, that was it? That was it, really? Well, we have something different. We have the bubble. Uh, it protects you, as as bubbles do. It also, it also technically gives you a location. Wow, we got another layer of armor. At this rate, at this rate, uh, those, those octolings would have had to do a lot just to uh, kill me. There we go. Oh, Bailey! What do you want, little buddy? Ba Bailey has invaded the, uh, the... Bailey has invaded the, uh... The Let's Play again. What? Okay, why is the text upside down? Also, yes, hi, buddy. He's on my lap right now. I'm not sure, not sure if you just heard him snort there, but, uh... Say, say, say hi, say hi, little buddy. Bailey says hi. There, there we go. Look, look, buddy. I'm in the middle. I'm in. I'm in the middle of doing something. You got. I'm in the middle of doing something, little buddy. Uh, I'm sorry. I cannot read upside down. Uh, hello. Can you can you hear me? Hello. You're holding that upside down. Oh. Oh, Agent One of the new of the new Squid Beak Splatoon reporting in. Agent Two also reporting in. We got we got an SOS from Captain Cuttlefish. Are you Agent Three? Don't worry, we're we're your, we're your new support team. Yep, we're taking over. We're taking over for the cabin. Well, we're gonna try. But we're but we've gotta hurry, or the cabin is is as good as sushi. Let's roll, Agent Three. Let's rescue Cap Captain Cuttlefish and the Great Sapfish. Yep. So as so as you guys probably already were able to tell, uh, Captain Cuttlefish got squid napped. So now we have Agent One and Agent Two, who looks oddly familiar. I don't know about you guys, but they look uh, but they look familiar. Anyway. Now we're moving on to level 20. Again, doing things out of order here. Oh, both oh, both of you are down here. Up, up. 
Up now 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 candy's now candy's being mouthy. I'm not Really really you do really Really Well Well you're hearing from them folks they <laughs> Both both dogs are down here barking up a storm Alrighty then. I'm gonna have to do a jump cut so so you won't have to hear those two just kind of barking up a storm. So I'm gonna be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Uh, yeah, so dogs are no longer uh, in the basement. Uh, I've... I temporarily banished them. Uh, yeah, so... So for some reason... They, so, okay, let me explain that. Up, oh, octolings with seaweed on their heads are super tough. Try taking the high ground. Got him. Anyway, so... Uh, so, in case, in case you guys don't, are unaware, I currently live in my parents' basement. Now, that's not a bad thing, of course, uh, because uh, where I live, rent... Actually, rent in general is just absurdly expensive for no reason. Like, if I, like, if I were to move out and uh, go to an apartment, I would probably lose most of my money just from rent alone, which is... Which is ridiculous. There we go. So yeah. So because I so because I live at home with my parents, both both dogs, uh, Bailey and Candy. Uh, no, normally, normally when as of right now I'm the only person home, so. So Candy, so Candy would want to be with uh, whoever's home, and Bailey, he just wants attention in general. So that's the main reason why he's my little buddy. Oh, that's not good. Hey, this map looks familiar. Oh, it doesn't matter. We're just, we're just, uh, we're just gonna, we're just gonna ignore that one here. There we are. Oh no, they broke my armor. There we go. Well, this is mine now. Anyways, anyways. So yeah, so Bailey normally follows me downstairs. And I've been noticing whenever when Candy's down downstairs, Bailey would sometimes get a bit territorial with her. Like not like not like the uh, the not like the uh, the violently aggressive territorial, just more or less. Uh... Wow, can't believe that actually worked. Anyway, not like violently territorial, but but like the more. Uh... Passive aggressive barking type of territorial. So the two of them decided to start an argument with each other in the middle of my bloody recording. Uh, now, and now I have to, and now I have to do. Uh, I have to. Yeah, it's it's annoying, but it's it's whatever. L luckily, situations like these are really. All right. Luckily, these guys are too concerned about, uh... There we go. Yep. I always prioritize the snipers, folks. Because I bloody hate snipers. No matter what game. No matter what game. Uh, Overwatch, I hate... Well, Overwatch is probably the only... Overwatch is probably the only one I don't really mind snipers too much. But that's just because I just... At least in Overwatch 2, I just don't see them too often. Then again, I don't play competitive. 
so my so my opinion is completely uh, invalidated. And even if I do see him all the time, I play I play uh I play tanks. And when he plays a tank, he can certainly survive a headshot. That's for sure. Oh god, there's two snipers. Surely that makes things annoying. Aha, I see that. Oh fuck. Well I'm a giant well I'm a giant drooling moron. Uh, anyways, yeah, so, yeah, so I hate, like, any, any game that has a sniper, I just like, um, Splatoon, I mean, there, there are secondly snipers in Splatoon, and even then, I don't see them too often, and even then, it's kind of easy to deal with. Another game that I play that has snipers in them are Team Fortress 2. And right now, I just hate sniper. I hate. Okay, so here's my issue with sniper in Team Fortress. Uh, sniper in Team Fortress 2, it's a class that can kill you at at any spot of the map at any range. And because he can kill you at any range in the map, no matter if it's up close or far away, he can walk out of spawn and get headshot by a random bot. And yes, I mean like a random bot. Because Team Fortress 2 still, is still having this bot problem. There we go. Yeah, now, now, luckily, don't see this bot problem that much anymore in Team Fortress, but it's still there. Believe me. Okay, how? Okay, how did that? Hit? And how can you see me from there? None of that. And I got and I, and I lost my train of thought again. Gotta I gotta love my gotta love ADHD, you know. Where you kinda just lose your train of thought all the bloody time. Uh let's see. Uh, I don't think I I don't think I finished my conversation about my dogs. So anyway, long story short, my dogs, uh every now and then they get into 
little arguments, you know, as siblings tend to do. They are bio they are biological siblings, after all. This sniper is really fucking annoying me. Oh, I Just, they, got, they just got <laughs> Wow, well, motherfucker really just watched that as as it was coming to him, huh? Okay. Okay. There we go. But yeah, they, they tend to get into arguments a lot. You know, bark, you know, bark, 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 bark at, bark at each other. What can I say? And they, this especially happens quite a decent bit in the basement. Because Bailey thinks he, Bailey thinks that that's his. Oh. Lovely. Anyway, Bailey thinks that's his area and not hers. Even though both are equally loud down here. So, yeah, nothing, yeah, nothing else for me to say other than uh, that Bailey is just being a, you know, he's being a little baby about it. There we go. Anyway. Level 19. You know what, I probably should have checked and see if I can upgrade some gear, but whatever. We'll we'll do that, uh... Yeah, we'll do that a bit later. Wait, can I shoot that thing right there? Hold up. I cannot. Good thing you have infinite ammo in this game. You know when it, you know when you you know when you really come down to it, this game really is just uh uh, infinite ammo, the game. I'm like, I mean, like, because here's the thing, even if you run out of ammo, you just have to go into ink form and you just passively regenerate ammo. How crazy is that, huh? Although then again, Overwatch is kind of the same way, where it's like, you have ammo, but you don't have to go find ammo packs. Like, you still, like, you still have to reload. So it's not quite like it's infinite ammo, but you have to re but you have to reload. Compared to TF2, where it's like you have to manually reload and find ammo packs or dispenser or be or play as the engineer with the Widowmaker, where uh, uh where as long as you can aim. Uh oh, this guy. Come on, there we go. Man, some action challenging platforming. Uh oh. Man. There we go. What? Okay, you must die. Uh oh. <laughs> Let me up. No, 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 no. Oh. Man. Sometimes I hate gravity. Wait. Wait, this is the final checkpoint. Well, I guess this is the final checkpoint. Uh, 
There we go. No, 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 no. Okay, good. Good. I keep forgetting you, you just instantly break open the, the barrier by just throwing a bomb at it. Ugh. Not sure if you can hear, hear those next cracks, but... Man, I love when I get the crack my neck and get those pricks out of me neck. Anyway... Now, yeah, where is this leading? Uh, absolutely nowhere. However... Aha! Unwork, unwork. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Not one of these again. Yep. Not the Octo Striker again. Well. It had to be right there, of all things. Really? That checkpoint. What? Oh, good thing I got that checkpoint. Okay, that's going the that's going the opposite way of what I want. Oh, nice. There's a punch there. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Bombed away, bombed away, bombed away, bombed away, bombed away, bombed away. Run away, run away, run away, run away. Alright, let's go, let's go deal with this guy. Yeah, 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 start flying in the air. Oh no, the layout has changed. Got him. Didn't think you didn't think you, you really thought you could get away from me there, huh, Puck? <laughs> well, you thought wrong there, punk. Alrighty. What? We only need like what? Two more or something? No, one more. Ah, uh, where, uh, where, where would this last? Where would this last one be then? Well, I, actually, hold on. Actually, I'm going to have to end the episode here, actually. <laughs> because uh, I didn't realize how long that took. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, despite the uh, interruption from my dogs. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the content that I do, please, su please consider subscribing, because I would really appreciate it. Uh... Please comment and like so this video can so the YouTube will actually realize, hey, this video is doing numbers. Uh, and with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode where uh, in the next episode where we're gonna be pretty much completing the rest of this uh, world and hop on to world five. Uh, with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Buh buh!